Hey, good morning. It's, uh, what do we got here, about 6? There you are. Yeah, 6 o'clock. Uh, 18th September. I'm still at Ao Naparatara, Naparatara Bay. That's what the Ao stands for, Bay. And you can see that uh, we've still got waves. This may not seem like a lot, you know, if you're in North Shore Hawaii. But this is, uh, this is choppy for this part of uh, the world. It's usually pretty flat here, you know. Little anchor biter, that's about it. High tide today is around 9, because 9 10. A little bit later than yesterday, so the water will start to recede. Usually about two hours before. So I've got a very narrow, maybe 20 foot wide strip. Unless I'm going to get wet, which I know. Anyhow, we're still overcast. We had more rain yesterday. It would rain and stop. Rain for an hour, stop for an hour. Rain for an hour, stop for an hour. So I managed to get through to between the rains. But we're going to see if we uh, have the same kind of luck we had yesterday. You know, five rains. That was all right. So I'm going to get to it. And we'll check you later. Hey, before I start, this might give you an idea of how how low or how down or how sanded out the the beach is. I mean, these are steps to get to the beach, and it's got to be close to three foot, two and a half, three foot, where I guess it was at one point in time. So we've got some rock barriers here to prevent the surf from getting up too high. Now, high tide, I've seen the water all the way up to the rocks, but I don't. I don't recall, I was here six years ago, I don't recall this being like this. Maybe that's why I found the rings yesterday, is this kind of weather for off and on for the past two months has pulled sand out, which is good for me. Hopefully we find some more goodies. Yeah, we got the uh, Excal 1000 Sweet Jane and the stainless steel scoop. Let's go find some goodies. It's about uh, 7.05 and the uh, storm is coming, mostly gone. And the wind was blowing pretty hard, I'd say 20 to 30 miles an hour. Fortunately, I'm in this I'm in a little covered pavilion here. They have a few of these along the, along the walkway above the beach. There's one over, over there too. So my backside is soaking wet. And, the front of me is perfectly dry. That's my main concern is keeping this camera and my cell phone dry. I don't care if I get wet. Or the detector, it's waterproof. So we've still got uh, some sprinkles coming down, so we'll give it a few more minutes. And now that the tide has gone out nicely, we can go out there and uh, see what else we can find. I got a few coins and one ring, another pair of glasses. And the one thing I've noticed I saw yesterday, I noticed it yesterday, but didn't think, thought about it more. And most of the tones I'm getting are not these short, sharp, crisp, ding, 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 ding kind of tones. They're more, they're more, it's kind of softer, spongier, kind of like a, a violin string. They're kind of wider when I, when I swing the coil over it. And they're deeper, they're six to ten inches deep. And these are coins and, and the rings I've been finding. And some of the targets closer to the, to the top, Having that ding, 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 real loud, real sharp, real short, crisp tone. But the ones that are deeper are, are a lot softer, and then I'll switch to pinpoint, and I'll get nothing. I'll go back to discriminate, and the tone is there. Once I get a scoop or two out, then, then all metal pinpoint works. So I don't know. Anyhow, I'm having fun. Got another ring. More coins and more trash. And the rain's just about finished. Hallelujah.
This is a, uh, I don't know if we're still a typhoon or a tropical storm. This is Bongkut. Yep, if you guys have Florence, we got Bongkut. Alright, check you later. Alrighty, back in the room. Yeah, right there. There's the messy bed. And here's my workstation. You can get a hair dryer at this place. Got a hot pot too in the bathroom. Put there. Refrigerator, air conditioner, big TV, 15 bucks a night, free Wi Fi. Yeah, good deal. Anyhow, game called on account of rain. Or should I say hunt called on account of rain? I did uh, hunt on the way back because the wind was to my back and I kept somewhat dry. But when I got back to the room, I had to wring out everything. Yeah, I, I made pools of water out front. Anyhow, I got about 20 something baht. Uh, I did get a second ring on the way back, one of those little punk, you know, the ones they wear when they go to a, to a fight, you know, so they can poke somebody's eye out. And this one, uh, similar to the one I got yesterday, the cat's eye one yesterday. It's almost like there's a naga or a dragon there on the side. So five rings yesterday, two today, no complaints other than, you know, I got wet, but, you know, it's only water, so... All right, so hopefully uh, this is the end of Typhoon Mankut. We're just getting the tail end. It hit, hit the Philippines and Hong Kong harder. So we're just getting rain over here and some wind. So that's it for today. And uh, we'll check you later. Good luck, happy hunting. Thanks for watching.